town in Denali. Okay. This is uh, this is where you get most of like the stuff to eat. There's a subway right here, and some ice cream st stores and the, and some grab and go kind of uh, Turn right stores as well. Right. There's a gas station. Your destination will be on the right. There's a gas station too. So yeah, you'll get most of the things over here. So finally we are entering this plaza kind of an area right outside Denali Park guys and you can see that there are some local restaurants here including some chains like Subway. They also have ice cream shops, some souvenir and gift shops and you can also have um, some adventure tours that you can book here like zip lining or whitewater rafting. They have those facilities as well. We now enter into the area of Denali Park where they give us a demonstration of how sled dogs are basically used um, in transportation in those mountainous terrains. As you guys know, here everything, especially during winters, is all covered with snow and transportation can be very challenging. So they've been using sled dogs for years. <laughs> Getting to pet some Alaskan Huskies. <laughs> This entire area of the park, as you can see, is basically meant for sled dog demonstrations. And this is also a facility where these Alaskan Huskies are trained, they are taken care of. They also have a vet on call if needed. And these are all trained dogs, basically um, for them to be used in um, transportation whenever needed. And as you can see here we have several tourists and we are also allowed to pet these alaskan huskies and that's fine they do have some of their staff um, kind of monitoring the area you can't feed the dogs but you can certainly pet them and they are all very well trained so that was a very good experience <laughs> this venture. Last thing, Husky. You guys are rocking up. I'm going to ask you about it later. <laughs> Keep it in mind. So now this is the area where they all called the tourists and everybody you can see is sitting on one side of the road. They are inviting all the Alaskan Huskies who are coming there with their staff and they are going to begin the demonstration for these sled dogs. Uh, just to show us how they operate, how they train these dogs and how does it really work in terms of transportation in this part of the region. As you can see guys, the dogs are getting extremely excited to, uh, I guess, demonstrate to us how they really function and what they have been trained in. And of course, we were told that after they do a good job, they get a nice treat. very interesting to know from the staff there and the trainers that even if you see the alignment of these dogs there are three different rows and there is a certain reason why these dogs have been um, attached or connected to each other in this way it's not at random and there is all like a science behind it to make sure that the job is done well and without much of an effort and trouble to the dogs themselves Photo, yes, photo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
now very hungry after this demonstration and decided to go into the restaurant that they have in Denali Park inside to grab a bite. So this is uh, Marino Grill. Uh, it's one of the eating places, actually the only eating place um, in Denali National Park. Um, right over there is Starbucks. Uh, so you'll get coffees. Uh, they have some wraps and sandwiches and stuff like that as well. And then over here we have, there you get burgers sandwiches, soup, fries, etc. Um, so you can come in here, just grab some food. Um, you pay at the counter here and then um, you can have, you have a seating area here. They have some seating available outside too for like the warmer Because weather. the place is so remote, it's, I'm sure it's a little hard from a logistic standpoint for these guys to get all the ingredients or even resources to cook or serve so this is they don't have many options here at Denali National Park when it comes to eating this is a, this is a good option though it's huge and it, it has quite a few options it's, it's a little expensive though which is expected yeah so like uh, we got a order of fries that was about seven to eight dollars so it is a little expensive <laughs> 